I worked with Samsung at CES to check out their new Samsung Vision AI. And here are four features it brings to home entertainment. The first one is search with AI, so you can click one button on your remote and find out a lot of information about whatever TV show you're watching. So if you want to know who the actors or actresses are, what other movies they were in, what scenes, different things like that, you can just press this button and a tab shows up on the right. And you can find out a lot. Number two is live translate. So if you're watching anything in another language and they don't offer subtitles in your language, well, Samsung Vision AI is able to do that for you and give you subtitles in your native language on the bottom of the screen. Number three is my personal favorite. It's called Universal Gesture, where you can use your Galaxy Watch to control your TV so you can navigate the cursor around the screen by like moving your wrist and then you pinch to select, make a fist to go back or double fist to go back to home. And number four, the home AI experience and pet care kind of bundling in two right here. Essentially, this is getting a deeper level of integration into your smart home. So for example, if you want to know like where your dog is, you can just ask like what's been going on today and it can find anything from your, your cameras that it recognizes as your pet and show you those videos so you can see like, hey, your dog was eating your shoes today. And Samsung made a focus on four key words. And those words were on device, connectivity, personalize, and openness. So that shows their objectives for Samsung Vision AI. So I'm pretty happy to see Samsung expanding TV capabilities, and I'm excited to use these new features.